So today we were coming for a ruling on an application for discharge that was filed on behalf of one of the job scholar in the state case. Uh, unfortunately, the matter was rolled over to the 19th of uh, October 2023. There is a reason that the court was not able to deliver the ruling. This is despite the fact that uh, all the papers that were required to be submitted on this behalf were submitted and uh, we expected that uh, today we would have a ruling on this application for discharge. But like what I said, we can advise that the ruling is going to be ready, so the matter has been postponed to the 19th of October. How is it generally after the health scare that happened a few days ago? He is certainly not 100%. He is he's not feeling well. As uh, was correctly reported last week, he was uh, passing out blood for the past uh, 10 days. The condition got worse on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and he had to meet with the engaged medical practitioner so that he was uh, medically examined. So he was uh, medically examined, and uh, the doctor observed that uh, his, um, high, his blood pressure was uh, extremely high and also that uh, he needed to have uh, some tests, which is called colonoscopy, quite sure, uh, where they need to examine what could have been the cause for him to pass out blood. So that uh, test is yet to be conducted, and we are hoping that in the next two days that is going to be done. But as of his condition currently, is not well. He certainly not well. Anything you say, maybe to the people of Zimbabwe and uh, after spending over 400 days, and we are approaching, I think, 500 days. Yeah, but I see anything that would be striking that you say it may be a message to the people of Zimbabwe. As usual, Honorable Scala would want everyone to know that you know, he remains resolute, he remains uh, strong, he is not moved with the persecution. Although it is coming with some some cost, like what you've observed, he's not been feeling off quite some time. But uh, he wants the general public to know that he remains resolute. Thank you very much.